Hi there, welcome to this video. This video is about different ways to give opinion about something. To deny repeating, in my opinion, it is better to use these words. Okay, let's start. First part is about, giving opinion about something. In my opinion or in my view. It is used when giving your opinion about something. Examples. Their concerns are, in my opinion, fully justified. In my view, the court made the right decision. It seems to me that. Used when saying that you think that something is probably true. Example. It seems to me that there is some truth in her argument. The next one is in somebody's opinion or view is that. It is used when saying what another writer's opinion is about something. Example. The judge's opinion was that she was fit to stand trail. His view is that consumers should be told the whole truth about the product they are buying. In his opinion, the portrait painter seeks to capture the moment when the model looks most like himself or herself. The general opinion is that the combined vaccine works better. Have or hold an opinion. It means to have a particular opinion. Example. Everybody has a different opinion of what America represents. For somebody, it is used when saying what someone's opinion is, especially when this is general opinion which also affects their other ideas about a subject. It is used at the beginning of a sentence. For Chomsky, language is an abstract system of rules which is used by human minds for transmitting and receiving ideas. Be of the opinion that or take the view that. It means to have a particular opinion. These are formal phrases. Until then, most scientists were of the opinion that these variations in weather were compatible with established climate patterns. As far as somebody is concerned. It is used when you want to emphasize that you are talking about the opinion of a particular person or group. Example. As far as he was concerned, the failure showed the limits of military intervention. From somebody's point of view. It is used when saying what someone's reaction to something is, based on how it affects them. For example. It is important to consider the situation from the point of view of the ordinary man in the street. Give, express, voice an opinion. It means to say what you think about something. Examples. Other writers have expressed similar opinions on the subject. In his speech he was simply voicing an opinion that was held by many people at the time. Make your views known about something. It means to tell people about your opinions, especially so that they can be considered when making decision about something that affects you. Old people seldom have the opportunity to make their views known. Second part is about, explaining somiting which itself has two parts. First part is words and phrases which be used when you are explaining something. This means that or which means that. It is used when saying what the results or effects of what you have just said are. That is, it is used when explaining the meaning of the previous word or phrase, by giving more information. Example. The book is about art in the modern period, that is, art since 1900. I.e. It is used when explaining the meaning of the previous word or phrase, by giving more information. Example. The new law will come into force at the end of next month, i.e. March 31st. I.e. is the abbreviation for ID est, which is Latin for that is. In formal essay writing, it is usually better to use that is. In other words or to put it another way. It is used when saying something in a different way, either in order to explain it more clearly or to emphasize the point that you want to make. Average incomes fell, 
while the incomes of the top 20%. In other words, the rich got richer. To put it simply, it is used when saying something in a simple way so that the reader can understand what you mean. Example. What the treatment aims to do, to put it simply, is to make the skin grow back over the wound. Specifically, it is used when saying exactly what you are referring to, when you are explaining something. Several prisoners reported some kind of physical abuse. Specifically, 42 were prisoned, 8 were roughly handled. Second part is about the verbs meaning to explain something. Explain. It means to give somebody the information that they need in order to understand something. Example. He was the first scientist to explain how the process of evolution works. There are a number of theories which seek to explain why zebras have stripes. Give, offer, provide an explanation. It means to explain something. Example. His attempts to give a simple explanation of his theory. Explicate. It means to explain an idea in detail. Example. It is essentially a simple notion, but explicating it is difficult. Set out. It means to explain facts, reason, plans by stating them clearly and in a carefully planned order. He sets out his pans for an ideal Roman city in the first volume of his work. Go through. It means to explain all the details about something in the right order. Example. She begins her article by going through all the reasons why people have opposed the use of nuclear energy. Outline. It means to explain the main ideas about something, without giving all the details. Example. In his introduction, Jack outlines the four main stages in a child's development. Expand on. The meaning is to add more details or information to what has already been said. Examples. Linda saw the ocean as the source of all life. He expands on this idea in his novel, Mock Dick. The author expands on his theme at length. Clarify. It means to make something clearer. Examples. This chapter aims to clarify some of the most important issues in genetics today. In his speech the Prime Minister attempted to clarify his position on economic reform. Elaborate. It means to give more details or information about something. Example. With the current evidence, it is hard to elaborate any further.